Hello, welcome to this Control Web Panel tutorial. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the new antivirus scan module in the CWP user panel. In our ongoing effort to provide industry leading security for your servers and clients, CWP is proud to release this latest update to our antivirus scan module, featuring the CLAM AV antivirus engine for detecting Trojans, viruses, malware, and other malicious threats. If you're not familiar with CLAM AV, it's the open source standard for mail gateway scanning software developed and maintained by Cisco Systems and has been included in the Mac OS server since version 10.4 within the system's email service. And it's the ideal solution to further control web panels commitment to being an industry leader in server security. To access the antivirus scan module, you can navigate to the file management menu here in the admin sidebar and select antivirus scan or from the dashboard, you can scroll down to the file management section and select the antivirus scan icon. The CLAM AV antivirus module allows you to scan your account, websites, folders, and emails for malware and trojans that may be using resources from your account or causing security issues for your visitors and users. You have options to scan your home folder, a web scan to check all your domains and subdomains, an email scan to check all accounts, or a custom scan where you specify a defined path that you want to have scanned. You can also check your scan history to see the results of scans that you've previously conducted. Here you can sort by date, type, files found, number of scanned files, and elapsed time. And under the action column, you can download the log file or view the scan report. The scan report includes details like the scan mode, the CLAM AV version, the elapsed time, known viruses, scan date, scanned directories, data scanned, infected files, scanned files, data read, and the log file, which you can download to view. Going back to the module, we can configure the home folder scan by clicking this icon here for general scan configuration. This lets us adjust the advanced options for the antivirus scan, including all match, which continues scanning within the file even after finding a match, bytecode, which loads bytecode from the database, bytecode unsigned, loads unsigned bytecode, bytecode timeout, sets bytecode timeout in milliseconds, detect PUA, detects possibly unwanted applications, detect structured, detects structured data such as social security numbers and credit card info. Structured SSN count sets the minimum social security number count within a file to generate a detect. Structured CC count sets the minimum number of credit card numbers in a file to generate a detect. Phishing scan URLs enables URL signature based phishing detection. Heuristic alerts, heuristic scan precedence stops scanning as soon as a heuristic match is found. Normalize allows you to normalize HTML, script, and text files. You can use normalize equals no for Yara compatibility. Scan PE files, scan ELF files, scan OLE2 containers, scan PDF files, scan SWF files, scan HTML files, scan XML based document files, scan HWP3 files, scan archive files, Alert unbroken executable files, including PE and ELF. Alert unencrypted archives and documents. Alert unencrypted archives. Alert unencrypted documents. Alert on OLE2 files containing VBA macros. Alert on files that exceed maximum file size, scan size, or recursion limit. Alert on raw DMG image files containing partition intersections. No certs to disable Authenticode Certificate Chain Verification in PE files. Dump certs to dump Authenticode Certificate Chain in PE files. You can customize these configurations as required, and then click Accept. To reset your configurations, you can reset the default with this button here, and Accept. Once configured, you can start the home scan. When the scan is complete, you'll see your scan results. To download the log file, click View Log File.
To configure your web scan, select Web Scan and then select Customize. Here you can select the domains and subdomains that you want to have scanned. And when you're ready, click Accept. Then you can set the scan configuration the same as we did with the home scan, with all the same settings that we already took a look at. Then when you're ready, you can start the web scan. And when the scan is complete, you'll receive the scan results. Again, you can download the log file by clicking View Log File. To conduct an email scan, you can customize that by selecting the domains you want to scan and then choosing the advanced options. You can configure the email scan to enable email signature based phishing detection, alert on emails containing SSL mismatches in URLs, and alert on emails containing cloaked URLs. Once you've made your configurations, click Accept, and then start your email scan. When the scan is complete, you'll receive the scan results, and you can download the log file by clicking View Log File. To conduct a custom scan, click Customize to define the suspicious path that you want to have scanned. Once you've chosen the path, select Choose Current Path. You can configure the scan settings here, accept your configuration settings, and then start your custom scan. And once complete, you'll receive the scan results, and you can download the log file here. And that's the new antivirus scan module in the CWP user panel. For more detailed information, you can check the following links. We hope you found this tutorial useful. Thank you for using Control Web Panel.